welcome back to calypso moon welcome in if you're new come join me taurus we're doing your reading second week of september if you have your sun moon rising or venus and taurus this could resonate for you mind that time is fluid this could be something that happened to you in the past something that's happening to you currently or something that's going to happen to you in the future this is a general message so all the messages or the story may not resonate with you at all if it doesn't or if it's something that you've already gone through check your rising sign to see if that fits the bill a little bit more of what you're looking for if you don't know your rising sign, go to Cafe Astrology and put in your birth date and time and that should tell you your sun, moon, rising, or Venus. That's the site that I go to. They usually have an option for a free birth chart or natal chart. Two of Wands. The Lovers. Nine of Swords, King of Swords. Somebody's definitely disconnected from a lover, somebody who they feel like they had a strong connection with. Um, somebody could be choosing two paths here. Definitely feel like somebody has a lot of fear and anxiety surrounding the situation. Somebody could be getting advice or giving advice to somebody. Um, telling somebody the truth here or I'm getting advice on somebody on something for me to have won. Five of Wands. There's some type of conflict, fighting, jealousy, competition here. Show me the lovers. Six of Swords. Somebody's trying to move away from a connection because of fighting, conflict, jealousy, multiple people involved. Show me the Nine of Swords, Ten of Cups. Somebody's also worried if they're ever going to find happiness like this again. Show me the King of Swords. Judgment. Somebody definitely um, wants to reconnect with somebody or resurrect a situation. Revisit a situation that made them really, really happy here. And we got the tower and temperance. I'm not going to take these. So yeah, something really got out of balance, got out of control, and something came crashing down. All right, let's get into your Celtic cross here, Taurus. And see what's going on for you for the second week of September. Approximately. The sun. You're feeling really happy right now. What's the challenge or crossing Taurus? Uh, ending. Oh, God, this is such contradicting energy. So I'm getting that you could be pretending like you're happy that something is over or you are really happy to be ending something. But this is your challenge here. Your challenge is the pain and hurt that you're feeling that something ended. So somebody, like I said, could be pretending to be happy. Somebody is feeling abandoned here. But I feel like they knew that this was a possibility because of all the past hurt 
and pain that this situation have been through. Four of Cups. Somebody could not have been focused on this uh, situation. They could have been distracted by other things, other offers, other love opportunities. Queen of Wands. There is possibly a third party in the situation. Somebody could be focusing a lot on their looks right now, their physique. Um, working out, something like that. Knight of Swords. Somebody definitely wants to speak their truth or tell somebody something. They want to be honest here in the future. Taurus, you're looking at yourself or you're looking or you're feeling like you want to come back into union with somebody, possibly after having a third party. King of Cups. Somebody does recognize that you are willing to offer them love here. Someone knows that you're willing to offer them love. Ten of Wands. Your fear is that too much has already taken place or transpired for this situation to be resurrected. And somebody hopes that it's not too late. Two of Wands again. Is in the outcome. Show me the sun. Oh. The sun is clarified by the high priestess and the five of cups. So yeah, you're trying to pretend that everything is all right, but Deep down inside, you know that you regret the situation. You regret how this situation turned out. And I think that you know that this person also feels like you regret the situation. Or vice versa. You might, be, your person might be um, feeling like you know that they regret something that they did to you. Ten of Coins. Somebody wants to get out of this energy here. Somebody wants, there was a long-term commitment here before, and now it's not together anymore. Somebody wants that back. <clears throat> we got the Knight of Wands. Yeah, there could have been some player energy here. Somebody could have been not satisfied with what they had in a connection. Again, being distracted by other options, other people. Um... Possibly a third party here. The strength card. I feel like this person has been through a lot. There might have been more than one incident that happened here. Because the Queen of Wands can also be a mistress in the situation. So... You could have thought that you looked too good to be treated this way, or if the person thought that they looked too good for it to be treated this way, possibly, or somebody did this because somebody looked good or thought they looked good. So there could have been some type of jealousy here. Taurus, I feel like you're hiding your feelings from this person. Again, this energy with the sun. I knew this Wheel of Fortune was coming out. We got the Tower, the Wheel of Fortune, the Lovers, and the um, Eight of Cups. Yeah, a situation ended bad badly and somebody decided to walk away for good here. Um, you guys, I feel like somebody was destined to meet here. Like, you two possibly could be some type of soul mates or soul ties or soul contracts or something here. But I don't think that this was meant to last forever. There could have been some type of karmic lesson involved here. 
but yeah it looks like this person has walked away permanently or you have walked away permanently and somebody's having a lot of regret about it the world yeah somebody um somebody here knows that you want to start a new romantic cycle with them and that you would probably give to them this time i feel like somebody here knows that you learned a lesson or you know that your person has learned a lesson but a part of the punishment i guess that they're trying to bestow upon you is to not start a new cycle with you definitely getting this person has moved on i didn't clarify the knight of swords show me the knight of swords in the future the hangman yeah this whole situation is still going to be stuck you're still going to be stuck trying to figure out how this all went down like this how did this end up happening trying to understand it i feel like what did I say? Somebody wanted to resurrect the situation here. And the hopes and fears, somebody's wondering if it's too late to resurrect the situation. I'm getting that Justin Bieber song. Is it too late now to say sorry? Cause I'm missing more than just your body. I can't sing, so stop judging me. <laughs> That's my song though. Five of Wands, what did I tell you? There's some type of jealousy or conflict here. I'm also getting, um, Taurus, you could either be jealous or upset or mad or angry and wanting to fight for this person because they chose something else or vice versa. This, this person could be angry and upset and wanting to fight for you because you chose somebody else. Let me get some romance angels on this because I guarantee you this is like some type of soul tie here. Some type of soul connection. But you guys are no longer aligned because we got the Queen of Wands and the King of Cups. You guys are no longer aligned in the situation. So at one point there could have been a reason or some some lesson that you guys were supposed to learn from each other or there was a there was a reason for your meeting you were meant to meet this person in life but you weren't meant to stay with them forever that's what i'm getting from this situation but somebody has a lot of regret there was definitely trust issues in this situation possibly because of third parties possibly because of competition stay optimistic about your love life Yes, that's what I'm saying. You might feel like this is the last person that you're going to meet like this, Taurus. Um, this might, you might feel like this is the last strong connection you're going to have, but that's not true. Separation. Yeah, this separation was meant to happen. Reconciliation. Somebody does want reconciliation here, but I don't see that happening. It came right on the world card, too. Somebody does want to start a new cycle here. But I don't see that happening. Romantic feelings, yes. Somebody's romantic feelings are still involved here. Heart to heart conversation. Somebody wants to come clean and be open and honest now. There's a lot of chemistry and passion in this connection. Y'all could have just really clicked together. And maybe that's what it is that was holding us together. Maybe y'all weren't soulmate. Love yourself first. Yeah, somebody had some self-esteem issues here. Finance and career. There could have been money issues here as well. Somebody could have been made to feel less than because of their work situation or somebody felt less than because of their work situation. All right, Taurus, that's what I have for you guys. Thank you so much. And I wish you the best on your situation. Until next time.